Meanwhile, aboard the Cajun Queen, Pierre LeBlanc, known by his fellow anglers as Scaly Pete. Daddy hunted sharks. I hunt sharks. It's in the blood. There was somebody better at this, you'd be following down, yeah? Oh, people, we got a lot of wrong ideas about sharks. Scientists so say how we gotta coexist. Now, how you gonna coexist with that shark? Shark just want to do one thing. That's kill you, eat you, and you out. What I do, I consider a sacred honor. Kill them all if I could. Too bad, eh? But 24 hours to a day. Shark spotted in Fatek Bayou. Uh. Several deaths reported. Shark can be identified by rusty harpoon embedded in flank. Get the f out of my way. Got a job to do. is an adult bull shark. Fast, fierce, and armed quite literally to the teeth, she has little to fear here in the Gulf. The muscular marvel confidently moves through its watery world. The predator's 350 fearsome teeth are put on full display. more common to a thresher shark, this bull makes creative use of her powerful tail.
A shark fin is a sinister reminder to humans that the ocean remains a wild and untamed domain. The bull performs an acrobatic feat worthy of an orca, cruelly imprisoned and put on display in a marine park stunt show. The big fish plunges to the ocean below. The bull's speed is astounding for a large marine predator. Shark is a rare, calorie intensive spectacle. emphasize that this sort of targeted violence is quite unusual for a shark. That shark is a good weapon on their nose. Go get him, Chan. How you doing there, shark?
pain no more. Catch me this shock myself. Oh, ho! Look at them teeth! Oh, she gonna make quite a metal beast! Got us some dinner coming, boys! Let's get her up on deck, huh? On board the Cajun crew, Scaly Pete looks over the catch of the day. Yeah, this my daddy's iron, all right. But this ain't D Shark. Not the one I was looking for. How do you know? How I know? Not big enough. This look like a mega to you. She's on for me. Hello! <laughs> Are you mama in there? Whoa! Well, why'd you do that? So I can identify her. Next time I see her, when I spear her. The tiny pup responds with an instinct for survival. You'll never want to turn off the Gamma. This big game hunter once posited that after an animal had tasted human flesh, it forsakes its natural prey in a deadly single-minded search for the most dangerous game. This mineral supplement wouldn't be necessary if this shark ate a more nutritious, well-balanced diet. Grotto provides a brief respite from the Sturm und Drang of the Gulf. Exhibiting behavior more common to whales and dolphins, this shark is able to use biosonar to locate potential prey.
Catfish are cavity nesters, so mind your crevices. Like most fish out of water, sharks have trouble breathing on land. We tend to think of sharks as the damage dealers, but they too get injured from time to time. After a struggle like this, the lactic acid in the shark's muscles has completely ruined its flavor. Fawtick Bayou has long been a favorite go-to spot for catfishing. Muscle contractions produce surges of electrical activity imperceptible to humans, but not to a shark. That shark really popped on screen.
The Fawtick Bayou area has lost 63 acres of marshland due to saltwater intrusion. Fawtick's keystone predators has led to a super abundance of catfish, which is just fine by local bully Rosie the Alligator. Makes you feel better? I ate the heck out of some crockpot alligator killed bossa bites earlier. A peculiar biological adaptation allows the bull to survive in fresh water.
muskie is a freshwater fish commonly found throughout the Great Lakes region, so I have no idea what it's doing here. Alligator comes from the Spanish el lagarto, which means the lizard, which really isn't that interesting. Some shark species practice cannibalism in utero. Thank you. 
Sometimes even sharks just need to dirty bulk. A local critic once wrote that Amos Beauregard was the Rodin of the Bayou, but Beauregard was functionally illiterate and had no idea who Rodin was. really a gourmand, the bull shark will eat just about anything. Greeks refer to sharks as the hounds of the sea, and this one is certainly living up to its reputation. expect much angst, ennui, and poor decision-making. 